Well, it's uh, the Great American Trailer Park musical, and it's a very funny, honky-tonk, uh, rockabilly, comedic show. The Great American Trailer Park musical starts in Stark, Florida, uh, and it's, it's called Armadillo Acres, and Betty, who owns the, the place, and her two friends, Pickles uh, and Linoleum, are kind of like a Greek chorus. They do all kinds of fun uh, things together. The wife is an agoraphobic. She doesn't come out of the house. She's afraid to come out of the house. The husband, Norbert, uh, is, it's their 20th anniversary now, and he wants to take her to the Ice Capades, and she won't leave the house, and he's really angry. His uh, brother, Delbert, takes him to the strip club, and he meets this stripper, Pippi, who's really no good. And she's on the run from her, her boyfriend, Duke. Well, what happens is, they sort of get a connection, and um, so they start having an affair. It feels like a stereotypical show at, at first, but it really isn't. It's, it's a very real thing. These are real problems, but done in a very comedic way. And, uh, you know, there's this whole drama, comedy unfolds, and the craziness just heightens till the end. My name is Pickles, and I am the 17-year-old uh, who is hysterically pregnant. Well, it's not your classic show. It doesn't have your, you know, your everyday, you know, pretty dancing girls. I mean, you have a pretty dancing girl, but she's a stripper. Her mother gave birth to her on the kitchen floor, so they named her Linoleum, but she's Lynn to her friends. I play Betty. She's the landowner of the trailer park, and uh, she's like a mother hen to all the, the people who live there. Well, my character is brassy and sort of, you know, ballsy, and she doesn't take any crap from anybody. I think everybody should come see this show. Well, the Great American Trailer Park musical opens uh, March 20th. It runs for uh, nine performances over two weekends. Uh, you can get a lot of our information, uh, you know, from the website, which you're on right now. Um, we have uh, all kinds of ticket prices, but we have two what we call cheapo nights. Uh, Wednesday and Thursdays, uh, the week between the shows at 7 o'clock. It's only $15 all tickets. Everybody should come see the show, but if you're under 16 years of age, uh, you might want to get parental uh, you know, uh, guidance to come or uh, you know, permission. And uh, you know, if you're somebody who doesn't like to hear a couple of F words here and there, you may not want to come see the show either. Actually, I think this is a great show for people who don't normally come out to the theater. It's definitely not the stuffy theater crowd. That's the crowd that we should have in here. The down and dirty fire hall, the average Joe who might not come to the theater normally. This would be a show that they will enjoy.